Welcome back. We have been seeing a pretty nice day here in middle Georgia, especially if you were just kind of looking at it from inside an air conditioned building because it has been hot and this is just the beginning. This is looking out right now on our 41 sky view overlooking downtown Dublin where we do see a couple of clouds down there, but otherwise not a whole lot going on. Temperatures sitting at 95 degrees this evening, still feeling like 100 and that's really been where we've been sitting the past couple of hours or so. Highs officially topping out at 95 degrees this afternoon in Macon. 92 is normal for this time of year and 72 is where we started out our day, so a very warm day continuing right now sitting at 95 here in Macon, but feeling like 102. You see that 98 in McRae feeling like 108 and feeling like 109 up in Milledgeville. So it is hot, it is humid, and we are really feeling it all across middle Georgia. But that's not really kind of the only thing going on. You look just out to our west, 102 over in Jackson, Mississippi, 106 in areas like Shreveport and Dallas, and that is slowly creeping into our area as we start to see more of that high pressure and that heat dome sliding east as well. We've got a lot going on, though, on this large map. So for us, it's all about high pressure, but you look out to the west, still dealing with Hillary up the west coast. We've also got this next area of spin down in the Gulf of Mexico. So um, a lot going on in the tropics as well. You can see that we've got several named systems already. Also one that we're watching pretty closely. So this is Tropical Depression 9. We just got that as a Tropical Depression at 5 this evening. This is expected to just move further out to the west, potentially becoming our next named storm, which would be Harold. Not going to impact us here in middle Georgia, though. Where we are watching, though, uh, is going to be Tropical Storm Franklin. So this is going to head further to the north, and then maybe we see it make a little bit of a turn either way. Right now, we're really not expecting any kind of impacts here in middle Georgia. Gert, which was named over the weekend, now a tropical depression, so not an issue. Emily also now no longer an issue, but we're watching this area right here for some tropical cyclone formation at least within the next seven days. Otherwise, for us, this is the forecast. It is hot. That heat dome is going to be moving into our area through the middle of the week and finally pushing out a little bit further back to the west as we're heading into the start of the weekend. So we will start to see a return for some cooler temperatures, but not before we see the intense heat through the rest of the week. Not going to get much relief from anything as far as any kind of rain or clouds. We're going to be staying dry and hot all the way into the rest of our work week, so you need to be ready for that. Check out these feels like temperatures into tomorrow up to 108 of those feels like temperatures. So the heat advisory is back tomorrow afternoon, Wednesday 104, seeing that 108 on Friday as well. If you're heading out tonight, it is staying warm though. 82 by around 10 p.m. 80 degrees still at midnight. We're back in the upper 90s tomorrow afternoon. I think quite a few of us could end up seeing triple digits before we finally get some rain and a cool down as we head into next week. In just 10 seconds, I'll look at our seven day forecast. At Volume Chevrolet, good oil changes for life, plus a 20 year, 200,000 mile warranty. Visit Volume Chevrolet, I 75 exit 187 in Forsyth. That's volumechevrolet.com. And here's your 41 NBC AccuWeather seven day forecast sponsored by Volume Chevrolet. It is going to be hot, hot, hot. All the way through the rest of this week, we're talking about triple digits, upper 90s. Our feels like temperatures are going to be even warmer than that. So we do have heat advisories already issued for tomorrow. Rain chances will start to increase those we head into next week, and that helps to cool us off a little bit. Yeah, very hot week. Friday, 99, but you mentioned earlier it will still be very hot. One game note already, Stratford and uh, Westfield's game has been pushed back because of the heat. It's going to be it's going to be really rough. Probably the first of a few we'll see that happen. Four. Thanks, Cecilia. Here's what's coming up. Shortly on NBC Nightly News with Lester Holt.